going on, everybody? Welcome to episode... Ugh. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to episode 85 of our Watford career mode, and today we have got a game for you. We got the second leg of the Carabao Cup semifinal against Chelsea at Stamford Bridge, and then we also are going to attempt to bring in one more player, depending on if a stupid non finally leaves or agrees terms or whatever is taking so long with that transfer. Um, if that transfer doesn't go through, then we'll, we'll have a second game today, and that game will be Liverpool. But since this is the nightcap for me, um, and you, this is more of your overnight catch-up episode for you guys in Europe, we are only going to do the one game and the transfer or two games. So it's going to be one of those types of things. But let's jump into this first game against Chelsea. A big one here, of course. Winner gets to the final. They are ahead on away goals. We need to score here. And uh, unfortunately, we might need to change a few things around. I, not too, too much, I don't think. But I think we're going to make the two changes. Max Irons is going to come in. Um, for Regelon and Nakim, he's going to move over to that left-hand side. But let's jump into this. We need a goal here, at least. Um, but if we win this game, we're through. So let's jump into it. Fabian racing into space here. Slips it across. Here's Ziyech. The new man here making his debut. And he slips in Moise Keane. And Moise Keane always hit the post. Oh, an early, early opportunity. Played in by Ziyech, who, as we were saying, making his debut today. After we signed him last episode. Funny he makes his debut against Chelsea. He is a going to be a Chelsea player. Next transfer window or however these teams do the window this year. He will be a Chelsea player. That's already been agreed. And he's making his debut against them today. Decore. Hakimi. One more in here. Here's Vinicius. He cuts back nicely. Gets it across. It's Moise Kane. Oh, it's a good save. Oh, we're having a couple decent opportunities early on here. It doesn't really happen very often against Chelsea. They always tend to shut us down, but it's starting out here as Vinicius goes for it and hits the bar. Oh, my God. How have we not scored yet? Nice tackle there. Decore. There's one more lovely stuff. And here's Ziyech here. He cuts back inside. Can he get a goal in his debut? Oh, easy enough save. He is left-footed. Had to go on his right there, but... Decent enough save, or straight at him, really, but decent enough a move. One more. Here's Fabian. Keen. Can he slip it through? He can. And here's Ziyech. Can he get away? He can. And Ziyech here goes for goal. That's a great save. Oh, I thought we could bring it back onto his left foot. We did. Didn't really go for the curl. Might have needed an extra touch for that, but it's another good save here. And Chelsea the moment seemingly hanging on Barkley tries to turn oh they managed to get that in there and that's a good save Ooh, Hanaki Williams with the attempt managed to sneak in them behind the defense and Rui pulls out a good save at the near post his first Chelsea's first shot I think last time we played them they didn't have any shots they've had one today so far and uh, we still need that goal into space. Here's Ziyech. Can he play this through to Keane? He can. And Keane takes it. Moves along with it. And now Keane's getting into a good space. A pick was set by Ziyech. And he cuts back inside. Moise Keane! Always oh, hit the post again! Oh no! Oh god. I can't believe we haven't scored a goal in this tie yet. We still need one at the moment. We're going out. Nice turn by Kane, and he goes for it again. It's blocked. It comes back to him. Blocked again. This is so oh, annoying, to say the least. Ball comes in on the corner. Punched away. Headed down. Vinicius goes for goal, and Kepa with the save. Militao. Fabian. Fabian is moving forward here. Can he slip this through? He can. Here's Ziyech. Who turns really nicely. Holds on to it. Can he slip this out wide? He can. Here's Keane. Back inside is Malia Sar. It's in the back of the net. And we have found the away goal. And at the moment we lead. And now a clean sheet from here will send us into the final. That is a big old goal. It's been coming and it finally comes 75 minutes into this game. And this is nicely done. It's played in. Is Malia Sar making the good run. Cuts back in. Has that shot. 
near post. Keppa not saving it. And Varane almost gets a block in. And Keppa should be doing a little bit better. But we finally beat him as we should have earlier on in this game at some point. But as you can see, 13 minutes to go. And we're 1-0 ahead. Nicely played. Can we get that out? We can. One more. Nicely done. Can we get this through to Barco? And Barco can take it. Can he seal this game up? It's Barco, and that's it. It's game over. And we're off into the final. Chelsea beaten again. Two games in a row now. We're going to beat him 2-0. I'm so sick of Chelsea. I'm so glad this might be it. No, we might get him in the Champions League, maybe, I guess. But that's a good finish from Barco. He slips through, and his pace just takes him away from Varane. He tried to pull him back. It's a good finish from Barco there. And another goal added. It's 2-0. Two away goals. We're going to win this 3-1 on aggregate. Massive. And another final awaits us. <sighs> Carabao Cup final. I'm not sure who we're playing. But we are playing someone. Because we have knocked Chelsea out in the semi-final. Very well done. A good performance from us, really. We've started to get the hang of Chelsea recently. We've played them so often. But there we go. They had one shot today, zero shots last time out. They nicked a late goal in the end of the first leg. So, you know, we've done what we've had to do. And we've moved on at Liverpool and Manchester United. Liverpool are 2-0 up with the home leg to come. It looks like Liverpool will be the team we play in the final. That's... That's a big one, obviously, but we'll roll with it. Um, transfer offer comes in from Max Ahrens. $24 million from Dortmund. New. No. Estupinan is still not. I don't understand what's taking forever with that transfer. I do not get it. I do not understand. But we have Liverpool next if Estupinan doesn't come through. Still hasn't come through. I'm not sure why it stopped me for a match reschedule. But we can also check who we play in the Carabao Cup. Transfer offer for stooping on again. This time from Augsburg. What's going on here? They're still negotiating. So I don't know. Um, we've accepted the Augsburg one, though. A £42 million bid has come in for Jetson Fernandez. That's a good bid. But uh, he goes nowhere. We're just waiting for a stupid non to leave, okay? As the Liverpool game is going to come, is that going to be this episode? Have they broken down? Augsburg have pulled out. Oh, okay, he's been sold. Six million has been added to the budget. Sporting have taken him on. Now let's go look and see if we can, we can bring our guy in. Um, how much money are we looking at here? Twenty-six million. Oh, our. How come our wage budget doesn't move on stuff like that? That is annoying. Okay, well, let's let's take a look if we can and see if we can bring in De La Vega. This is actually going to be rather tight. Um, let's go down here and take a look. Here he is. Pedro De La Vega. They want between 21 and 27. I think we're going to be able to get this over the line. It's going to be tight. But we are going to bring in another winger, which is uh, obviously very important. You get that stuff floating around there. All right, let's see. He's at Bordeaux currently. Offer a transfer fee. We're going to offer twenty million to start. Let's just let's just start here. Let's see what happens. They want twenty-eight with a sell-on fee of fifteen percent. We're going to counter. Propose new transfer fee. Let's go down to twenty-three. They really are... Oh, come on. Don't do this, guys. What did we try? 23? Can we get this off of here, please? Stop trying to nitpick at what we have. Advance. Um, edit sell-on clause. We'll bring it all the way up for you if that makes it feel better. I don't mind. 25%. They accepted $25 million. Now... Can we bring him in? Negotiate. We're going to see what he wants in terms of wage and stuff like that, but it's going to be tight. Let's uh, squad roll. Rotation. He's comfortable with rotation. Um, 
four year deal. Yes. Disregard release clause. He wants 41,000. Can we just accept? We can just accept that? Is that good enough? All right. Well, there it is. De La Vega has come into the club, and we've done it. And I think our squad is complete. De La Vega, he's uh, got some good stats here. We're going to take a look at him in just a moment. We'll bring him up. <sighs> oh, where do we... Where do we bring him to? Okay, and then De La Vega. Do we bring him onto the bench? Striker, Cam. For Graylish, I guess. Though we have two wingers here on the bench. Enziak in the starting lineup. We probably don't need that. But yeah, we have two Cams. We'll bring him off for the moment, Kent. But Kent's a good player. We, we've we've got a, a lot of proper good players, all right? It's difficult to get them all in. But look at this lad. 98 pace, 97 acceleration, 97 agility, 90 or 88 jumping, 99 sprint speed. What's his shooting like? We have that anywhere. 85 ball control is pretty good. Um, 70 finishing, 88 dribbling, though. He looks like a proper good player, and he can be like Barco coming in late in the games. And, you know, having that extreme pace, if we can bring them both on at the same time, that would also be something else. I mean, it really, really would be. Um, but next episode, we'll be back to our three-game schedule. We'll have Liverpool, Villa, and Leverkusen. And then we will be playing Liverpool in the cup final. Actually, we have mm, a cup final here. I want to do that as an one-off episode. So I think we're going to do two. We'll do Liverpool, Villa... And then we'll do Leverkusen, Tottenham, and then Liverpool. And then we'll be back to how our schedule goes, guys. But we're going to end this video here into the Carabao Cup Final, which is coming soon. And then we also found ourselves a new winger. And we have our final squad for the final half season. And uh, it's looking pretty good, guys. But from now, I hope you folks have, of course, enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more. And peace.